I wanted to make this little video showing what I've done so far. I took apart these uh, Sync 3 modules. Both of them have navigation. Um, so this module, the, the, this is one of the chips. This is the second chip that goes in here on top. And this is for the other module, there's a chip inside. So what I figured out by switching these two, I realized that this small square chip is actually the storage. This is like an SSD or a hard disk, whatever you want to call it. This, that's what this is. Nothing more. The entire brain is actually in the bigger chip. So the bigger chip is, like my car, for example, had a problem that uh, where the navigation, it was having a navigation fault. And I tried to fix it by changing the APIM. And so, so this is my original APIM. I changed it with this one. But then this one had a fault as well of something to do with, uh, you know, this one actually just completely froze and the touchscreen wouldn't work anymore. So I tested the touchscreen and the touchscreen worked because I bought a third APIM, which is in the car now. Um, you can kind of see it there. So I bought a third navigation APIM and now I'm going to return this one to the seller because it's not working. But the third one's working fine, perfectly like a new car. But uh, what I thought is that maybe I can just switch the main board to both the chips and maybe it'll work. And that's how I learned that this is a SSD board or a storage board. Now, this board controls everything. So if your navigation is bad and if you're still like being able to see some image on there, that means your storage is probably good. So you just have to replace this board. And this board you can find on like Alibaba, I think. I found it on Alibaba for like a little more than a hundred bucks, 150 bucks. Honestly, if you want to save money, you could just buy some used one, but then you risk getting damaged again. But on Alibaba, they have brand new ones, which I'm assuming are fixed so they don't get damaged. So I'm going to order one from there and then I will fix my, my existing APIM and use it or in a different car because I have three fusions so I'll just use it in my other fusion and then hopefully it'll be working anyways uh, I just wanted to make this video to let you guys know thank you for watching